With Halloween approaching, students are jumping into the spooky spirit with their costume ideas. But the question is, how appropriate do they plan to be? With finals week approaching, students have been putting more time into their studies, saying goodbye to their beds and hello to all-nighters. With the semester winding down, students have been running low on their meal plan, leaving them hungry and miserable. Students are now required to move off of campus by their senior year due to overcapacity, leaving them alone and without a place to stay. Buffalo State's 22nd Annual Art Show gives students a platform to showcase their work to the public. For the Buffalo Review, I'm Brittany Edward. Buffalo State's housing policies has made some drastic changes over the years. Students are now required to move off of campus by their senior year due to overcapacity, leaving them alone and without a place to stay. I was like, kind of like homeless in, in one point, point in time, like I didn't know what to do. Like, I feel like housing should do better with that, like just because you're a senior or a junior, like, you, you shouldn't have to be kicked off of campus. Students have resorted to off-campus housing, such as Campus Walk and Monarch, but have said that they are too expensive for their liking. Being that we're not, we're not from Buffalo, we should have the option of staying closer to campus because not everybody has a car and not everybody can afford to live off campus. For the Buffalo Review, I'm Brittany Edward. With Halloween approaching, students are jumping into the spooky spirit with their costume ideas. But the question is, how appropriate do they plan to be? I feel like anything where it can offend someone, whether it be, you know, disastrous or religion or race, any type of culture is wrong and it should be paid more attention to. Students emphasize instilling the principle of respect into costume ideas. People do use Halloween costumes to appropriate other people's cultures because to put on those things and make a mockery of someone's culture is very different. And if you don't show respect while you do those things, then you really shouldn't be wearing that as a costume. For people who are actually like black and Native American, it's kind of disrespectful because you don't know like, what's behind all of it. You're just wearing it just to look cute. My culture is not the costume. Concerned students hope to make a change in today's Halloween culture. For the Buffalo Review, I'm Brittany Edwards.